fought, give Maryland credit, championship teams make championship plays down the stretch. And uh, I'm very disappointed in, uh, in our effort in the first half. Uh, I think they had eight offensive rebounds for the game, seven in the first eight minutes. I think they had uh, 15 free throws for the game. Um, 11 of them in the first half. And uh, I think if they don't get the two at the end, they'll need two in the second. Um, I thought, for us, I thought Rocket Watts played unbelievable defense. Um, Colin, you know, they hit four threes at the end, um, 12 points at the end. They scored 14 points in the last three minutes. They scored, what, 16 points in the first 30 or 14, 14, 14 points in the first uh, 17. Minutes. Yeah, whatever. Whatever it was, uh, they deserved to win the game. We deserved to lose the game. Uh, Wings didn't rebound. Uh, Xavier looks on paper. He had a good game, but he uh, was plays at the end. The blurs, the, the, uh, the double screen on Rocket. Uh, Probably played Xavier too much. He's got a lot going on, and he he uh, just played up the depth because we had to. So um, I don't know. You probably got better questions, and I got answers. But you know, it's a shame too that uh, I think we're down 23 to 10 on the boards in front of my team that stood for rebounding. It's embarrassing. It's even more embarrassing when you lose by one. In the which means the second half you all rebounded them by a ton. And um, I don't know, anybody wants to know why I get on Aaron Henry? Well, you know, first half, how to rebound, second half, scores five, gets five. Uh, we just didn't play good enough. We didn't make some winning plays. I thought early we missed a lot of good shots. They were half down. But give Maryland all the credit. They, uh, you know, I love the way uh, they did not take a lot of bad shots. And uh, we, we had some guys taking threes that have no business taking threes. And um, it's okay when you're 10 up or 15 up. It's not okay when you're 2 up or 3 up. So, questions? Turp Talk is brought to you by Viner Four Gates Consulting. Call Viner Four Gates for all of your IT needs. In the D.C. Baltimore area, you could reach us at 301-251-2900 or on the web at www.vinerforgates.com. This is Mason Viner. Listen to the Young Terps podcast on capitalsportsblog.com and terptalk.com, the number one rated Maryland sports podcast. Uh, Tom, uh, in that late run, Smith's Well, we had a freshman in the corner that was supposed to stunt it, but Xavier was so tired that he just, you know, he didn't get out. The next time he got out, great. So I just say they made a good play. We had a blown coverage, that's all. Coach, obviously you haven't seen the film, but do you think this film with the atmosphere and the way the guys fought could be some good uh, tournament prep film? <laughs> you know, I don't know. I'm, I'm, uh, I would like to thank our fans. I thought they were phenomenal. Um, I'd like to say I'm sorry to my championship team because for us to go rebound like that is an insult to me and them. But, uh, you know, I'm not thinking about the tournament. I'm not thinking, I'm thinking about trying to win another game because uh, we're finding ways to lose instead of finding ways to win. And I know some of the reason for that, but I don't know all the reason for that. And uh, you know, give give Colin credit, man. He, I didn't think he four shots all night, and uh, hit some big ones down the stretch. Tom, the team, this team has struggled a little bit closing games out. A 14-0 run for Maryland the last 308. 
I'm just curious to you, is it, is it any one thing? Is it a mix of things? What do you think it is? I think some of it's my fault. You know, I'm playing Cassius and Xavier too many minutes. I think that some of it is those two guys got a lot of stuff on their plate and maybe mentally we're struggling. Um, but, you know, sometimes you need somebody else to step up and the only guy that's stepping up and, and he missed a couple of shots bad, but, uh, you know, I just, I'll take Rocket's energy and his, how hard he plays. He can miss some shots. I can live with that. Uh, at least he competed. I think some guys competed like they need to compete. So we're going to have to, the other guy I thought did compete. I don't know how many minutes he played, but I should have played him more. Kyle Lawrence went in and got some big rebounds and um, did some things in traffic that he hasn't done since the Michigan game last year. And so, so that was a positive, and uh, hopefully we'll build on that. Tom, how much of this is, we've talked about the Big Ten being something we've never seen before with what 11 teams maybe in the turf. And is it difficult to adjust to that as, as players to, to every single game, no matter what, what name is on the other team, no matter how big your lead is, every game seems like it ends like this. Well, you know, I appreciate the excuse. <laughs> um, but you're playing in front of the, every former alum that ever played here. And that's what's wrong with the world right now. We don't play for enough people. And we play for ourselves. We're selfish. And, uh, you know, if you can't get fired up for that, with the crowd the way it was, with game day here, with then there's something wrong with your ticker. And that performance in the first half, that was something wrong with our ticker, which the only guy that has to take blame for that is me. And I'll be more than happy to take it. But uh, no, that, that's not because there's a game every night. Um, example, Maryland has a game every night. You know, they're the only ones that have kind of sustained through it. But uh, give them credit. They uh, Mark did a hell of a job. And, and uh, you know, he's got two very good players. But I don't think it's very good players that would beat you. I thought it was those other guys that guarded and checked and rebounded and, and did a lot of good things, you know. Everybody's got five, six, seven rebounds. They're athletes. Mine got one and two. Uh, so I. Uh, no, I, I, I'd like to take that. I uh, appreciate the help, but uh, no, I'm not going there. I, they got the same thing we got, except for some things we've been through. But it's, uh, we just can't lose a seven point lead with three minutes left at home on, on blown assignments. That's, that's not right. Anything else, guys?